We are taking a look here at workflow contexts, which are a way to access information about workflow runs, variables, runner environments, jobs, and steps. Each context uh, is an object that contains properties, which can be strings or other objects. In this example, we have a context called secrets, and it's giving us access to our uh, sensitive uh, variables that we want to pass to our workflow. Let's take a look at all the contexts that we have. The first being GitHub. This is information about the workflow run. We have ENV or environment, which is about environment variables that are available. We have VARs, which are, uh, you can think of them like environment variables, but they're variables that we were passing in uh, to our function that might not be necessarily sensitive. We have a job, which is information about the current running job. Jobs, and this is specifically for reusable jobs or workflows, sorry. Uh, information about steps, uh, runner, I'm not sure why I have a capital R in there, but it's just a runner, secrets for secrets, strategy for the matrix execution strategy, which we'll talk about in another video, and then matrix, which contains the matrix properties defined in the workflow. Uh, oh, and needs and inputs. <laughs> and the difference between needs and inputs, I don't know why they don't call this one outputs, but needs is outputs and inputs are inputs. But there you go.